So, Shalom, Dr. Mike Evans. It is an honor to meet you. It's mutual. You are well known all over the world for your prominent uh, support for Israel as a Christian Zionist. Well, I don't know about all over the world. I don't think they know me in North Korea, <laughs> but we are known, yes. You are the founder of the Friends of Zion Museum. You're the founder of uh, the Jerusalem Prayer Team. Right. And you meet with more heads of state than heads of state. Why should Christians all over the world should stand with Israel? Listen, Christianity is a new religion. It's not 6,000 years old. It's not 4,000 years old, not 3,000 years old. Christianity came out of Judaism. It came out from the Jewish people. It was, it, they were Jews. They weren't Italians. They were Jews who believed in these things. And the truth is, Christianity was birthed here in Jerusalem. What unites all Christians actually believe? If they bless Israel, God will bless them and their nation. If they curse Israel, God will curse them and their nation. It's very serious. Tell me please, what's so special about the relationship between Jews and Christians? Well, the first you have to identify what is a real Christian. You have fake Christians and real Christians. Real Christians love the Jewish people. Many people see you as a bridge between uh, Christianity and uh, Judaism, between Jews and Christians. What is your vision for this uh, friendship? Listen, the, the Israel never lost a real war. But the enemies of Israel never fight real wars anymore. They fight wars of attrition. They fight ideological wars using social network, media wars where they tell lies. They fight economic wars with BDS. Well, these are invincible wars, invisible wars. You don't see it. We have to fight these lies with the truth because the problem with lies, if you tell them enough times, people will believe them as the truth. Dr. Mike Evans, besides praying, what can Christians do to support Israel? Well, they can do everything. Number one, look what they did. They brought about the recognition of Jerusalem as Israel's capital. They stopped the funding of uh, terror in the PA. Christians are doing these things. They're the ones that are doing the heavy list. Listen, the majority of Zionists in the world are not Jewish. They're Christian. That sounds like heresy, but there's 750 million Christians in the world and a large percentage of them are Zionists. So it's an astonishing number of people. We want Israel to know you're not alone. Israel's friends are a thousand times more than her enemies. Do you realize that you're living in a day where most of the nations of the world are friends of Israel? I meet the leaders and I know this. Well, thank you very much for this great interview. You truly make a difference and uh, you are an inspiration to millions. And I am sure that it will continue to grow more and more. Thank you, thank so you much. very much.